Welcome to Film Addict. Ba 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 ba. I am your host, the Film Doctor. What? 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 I'm like, okay. You understand that your background's blurred, so you're blurred. You just look like a a blurry image doing dumb shit. <laughs> You know, you're taking slavery back quite some time with these shenanigans here. It's okay, and now he's Magic Mike all of a sudden. Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> I, Michael, I want you to know, I tried to buy a Peacemaker hat for this episode. We had to get this out quickly, otherwise you would have seen me with a Peacemaker coming on for this entire episode. Uh, if it covered your whole face, I wouldn't be mad. <laughs> Welcome back to Filmatic. That is a hater over there. <laughs> uh, welcome back to Filmatic. Oh, we have a hot TV show to dissect. Hot, 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 hot. Smoking. Like smoking. Like no. You know, you know what that's from? Anyway, uh, we have a hot TV show to dissect. Peacemaker. Do you want to taste this piece? Starring John Cena. Yeah. Can we not say his name? Can we say JC? JC. Let's just say JC for now on. <laughs> Coming to us from HBO Max. It is an HBO Max original. If you want to check it out, you can get it there in HBO Max. <clears throat> Again, you want to humbly give us anything, we will accept it. I mean, honestly, I need five bucks for gas, HBO Max. So if you could just swing that, that's a really good sponsorship. Uh, I do have to go back to work tomorrow and uh, just a little, little short on, on gas to get there. Well, let's jump right into our film review. Peacemaker. I'm going to go ahead and get mine out the way because I feel like you're going to take up a lot of time to say a whole bunch of nonsensical BS. And I'm going to shoot straight to the point and say that JC, uh, I hate with a passion. Okay. No, JC. I know this is a live show, but I will find a way to bleep you out whenever you say it. JC, it's my review. Okay, so JC, I hate, and I don't think that his character, Peacemaker, is a one that deserves a spinoff. Um, so they create... They, create, they take Suicide Squad and they take his character, which was not a really good character at all, and give it a spinoff show and put a sidekick character on this shitty side character from the original, the Suicide, not original Suicide, but the Suicide Squad. And that sidekick in Peacemaker is funnier, better, more entertaining than Peacemaker and deserves his own spinoff show, that being Vigilante. Um, I don't, I just feel like JC tried too hard to try and be funny inside of this whole thing. Um, and granted, I think that just the people around him brought more humor. The bird, the fucking eagle, was funnier than him, in my opinion. The eagle was not funnier than him. The, the eagle was funnier than him. He was not. Yes, he was. Eagly is hilarious. <laughs> Eagly should go on stand-up tour. Um, vigilante, hilarious. Uh, even the, the black chick, I don't want to say who she is. Because I feel like that's giving it away. But she, at times, she was funny. Uh, the, the white chubby guy, um, he's funny. JC, not so much. Uh, acting, again, Vigilante. I'm going to give the award to Vigilante. I think for his character, he played it down to a T. No one else really stood out to me in terms of acting. Uh, music, yeah, that's what it was. Special effects, cinematography, meh, is what it was. Uh, storyline, here's the thing. Mm, touching on story. The story that they have from The Suicide Squad with the stupid fucking starfish shit, and then to have this with butterflies. Uh, uh, it's a stupid story. S stupid storyline. Now, was it entertaining to me? Yes, with or without JC, but I think it would have been in the A range if they didn't have JC in it. However, they did, and upon all the things that I'm bringing up, I'm going to say that this movie deserved 
a solid B. It's a TV show, <clears throat> number one. Number two, uh, I completely disagree with everything you said. Uh, let's take it from the top. Um, acting. John Cena does a fantastic job. JC. He did a fantastic job in The Suicide Squad, which is why he got a spin-off. No. They don't just give anybody stuff. No, they gave it to him because he's JC. If it was The Rock, they would have given it to him, too. John Cena is perfect for this character. I love him as Peacemaker. Yeah. Super, super great. Uh, the cat, the, I love the cast, actually. I love the entire cast. Now, don't get me wrong. If I had to pick a star, I would pick Vigilante. Um, Vigilante, whoever that, I don't know the actor's name, and I apologize, but you were amazing in this. Um, you did a fantastic job as uh, Vigilante. I appreciate you, but the acting, Harcourt was good, uh, Economos was good, Adebayo was good, Mern was good for what he was doing. That cast, acting, incredible, James Gunn, you know what you're doing. We're going to give you shout-outs and praise when you deserve it. Uh, the story, I thought the story was pretty good. I mean, it tied in because they were fighting this um, in the Suicide Squad. They were fighting this giant starfish, so it was kind of funny. Like, oh, no, I'm fighting a giant ball, blah, 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 blah. So, Butterflies kind of made sense, and, and the story in general kind of made sense. Um, we get to learn more about uh, John Cena as Peacemaker, and <laughs> uh, just a side note: um, my stethoscope isn't a toy; it really works. Yeah, I know it's supposed to. But anyway. Okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, yeah. So I thought uh, the story. I thought the story was, was good. It wasn't the best story ever, no, but I thought the story was pretty good. Yeah. I enjoyed the, the entire cast. You can't even say pretty good. Yeah. You enjoyed butterflies? You would. You would. You seem like the type. Fantastic job. I was so excited for, you know, it's crazy because Michael had to remind me to watch this, right? And y'all know how I hate You know, I don't do this weekly episodic thing. I want to watch it all the time. I sat down during, I think, a week of episode five, and I was like, oh, I have to watch it had me hooked. I enjoyed it. I think regular audiences will enjoy it, especially for something coming from DC, where DC's had a lot of misses. You know, they've had some... They've had some a swing and a miss! Which, by the way, we we don't have the spoiler effect yet, but, and you'll know what I'm talking about. Anybody that's seen this, uh, the Peacemaker show would know what I'm talking about. I did enjoy when he was, at the last episode, he's leaving the place, and he comes across some people that um, they were late. They weren't there um, <laughs> in a timely fashion. So I, I enjoyed that. Um, I enjoyed this show, man. I, I gotta tell you, I enjoyed the show. And I think a lot of people will enjoy the show. This is a hit from DC. And of course, this was with, with James Gunn, the director. You gotta give him credit. He does a lot of good work. Um, you know, so Peacemaker, man. Peacemaker's getting a solid A for me. Solid A? All right, guys, that's all we have for you guys today on some bullshit. That, 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 no, that's, that's all we have for you guys today on the bullshit. Uh, thank you for tuning in here. Uh, sorry that you had to hear that, um, because it's definitely not an A. Peacemaker is great. Go check it out on HBO Max. You can check it out, but we're not giving it an A. Uh, we're going to actually go back and edit this live show and change his, his answer to a C or B minus, because that's not an A. No. Uh, anyway, please don't forget, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that bell. Do all that jazz. Tie a little note to a pigeon's leg. Send it on its way. Put a message in a bottle, and go ahead and throw it into our shores. Mm, oh, some, I don't know what all this bullshit. Anyway, uh, no, we're we're not. We're not. Yeah. Tell me I was right. No, no, and and we're out of time to hear you continue to ramble about your 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 ignorant things. We we've done the ending of the show. This is where I say please like, comment, and subscribe. Do all that jazz. I did all that, and then the, the end part to show you that this show is over and we're no longer going to talk about your your shitty little rating that you gave me that's not accurate. I say, and this has been another exciting episode of, and then you jump into it at the same time. Ready and filmatic.